Hello fellow tankers and gamers, this is going to be a short video because this is a fast match in Siegfried Line with an encounter type battle and this is why Siegfried Line should not be in Gold War because immediately you can already see an Object 120 and all the tanks taking up fire positions. All the fast reload tanks are now shooting each other from across the map because they can see each other. I'm hauling ass across the map because I don't want to lose any spotting and assisted damage to the actually there was only two other tanks that had that capability and I didn't really worry but hey if you like fast tanks like and subscribe and if you don't like Sig Free Line like I do in Cold Remote also like and subscribe and comment down below if there's any other reasons besides being able to see each other from across the map from this starting point now I'm the Scorpion 90 it's not my favorite tank I have to be honest with you I do prefer ATGMs I but this is a fast boy and thank God for that which is why I'm doing really big circles and not sitting still but at the same time I'm also trying to keep my eye open to see if I, there's any tanks that haven't been detected yet and meanwhile I'm raking in almost six <laughs> over 6,000 assisted damage and we're barely a minute into the match holy crap this is all happening so fast and I, it was this was early in the morning thankfully 7 in the morning I had only 4 sips of coffee and I guess the other team did too or maybe RNG suddenly favored my team for whatever reason definitely let me know what you think because there's going to be a moment coming up here where I was like hmm by all accounts this should have worked and yet normally I wouldn't have expected incoming missile now this is kind of like pay attention here okay technically yes the penetration on the standard round for the scrubbing knight did have the ability to overmatch the upper plate of the chief the mark II, and as long as I high rolled I definitely should have taken the loss of health just didn't expect it. Not with this tank, and just not with this game sometimes. So that's why I don't prefer the 90, because sometimes it's like, yep, you gotta aim those shots, or else you either do tracking damage, by tracking damage, I mean you break the tracks, and that's it. So I was really surprised by that. And that's where I started going, okay, now I'm suspicious about RNG. We know it's not supposed to favor certain sides, but it just feels that way. Now, obviously, once I realized, oh yeah, we're also like, 15 tanks to 8 and again it's like this is all happening really fast I am now almost to 9,000 assisted damage definitely got to move up thankfully my team is also moving and yet again I don't know if this was poor team play on the opposing team because they didn't make any effort to go to the city or did they realize we're on secret line we're open we need to find any cover we can because we're just gonna get shot as we move into the city so let me know what you think, because right now we're actually coming up on the end of the match. I see this thing for Ashio, this is the first time in this entire match where I feel in any, any way, shape, or form threatened. But unfortunately for them, they're the last on the team, and I actually have excellent and way too much team support. So, let me know what you think. Was RNG favoring my team? Does Siegfried need to go away from Cold War mode? And wow! For the first time in a long time, there's not only one, but two Object 120s. So yeah, the whole tank destroyer light tank dynamic actually worked, weirdly enough. Um, I guess that's a weird benefit for not having any real missile, missile firing tanks in a match. I don't know, but it was way too fast for me. But then again, I know Wargaming really wants those fast matches, so we keep turning and burning and suddenly don't have to get all upset because, oh, we sent 15 minutes to lose. You decide. But I was like, I, I, this was total premature ejaculation for me. I was like, didn't even get a chance to realize if I was having any sort of fun because it's all over by the time I realized it was done. It, it, was, it was so fast. Really impressed that I did a good job as a light tanker, but at the same time, man, some people like need to drink their coffee before they go. In fact, this was such a short video that I decided to even throw in some highlight reels. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, but keep in mind, let me know what you think. Was this just a fluke? Was this just RNG? Or, yeah, Siegfried Line has a bias to a certain side. Thanks for watching. I hope you keep tracks on the ground. RNG's in favor, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.